Hi there guys, uh, so second battle, um, again I've just given a bit of hints and tips for myself, from myself, um, I'll show you what I'll do for the second battle. So this second battle, um, on bonus battle 6, uh, you you can see what your what one character will be, which is a strength of 10 and 27 on the health, 27,000 on the health, but the other two characters will could be completely random, could be very weak, could be quite strong, um, th there's no good or bad way about it. I don't know what they're going to be, um, but generally it's, it's in some ways the same. Um, I literally put in, I would say, one of my strongest characters in. Um, so, if I, I would say if you've got uh, an Elite 3 card, um, gold, um, you'd probably be able to do it. Um, maybe two Elite 3 cards. So, let's just say I put in two random Elites. Um, or if you've got three random three Elites, cool. If you haven't, then I don't know, let's just try an Elite 2 card. I don't know if I'm going to win this or not. Nah, don't know. Um, but generally, I'll put in someone stronger. But again, this is just a test to see if, it, if it's going to work for me. Um, you can see, um, I don't rank up my moves at all. Um, I only rank up the moves generally if I feel I'm going to use them a lot. Or if it's just there to help me. Apart from that, I use the money that I use to get booster packs. Um, so I can... Literally, I get a gold boost pack every day, so I at least do this um, bonus battle six at least three to four times, so I can at least get one booster pack a day, and that's how I play the game, and that's how I get the characters that I get. Um, anything else? I just, that's just me farming in my spare time. <laughs> um, I can't help but play this game; I love it. Um, so Catwoman again. Um, I've got four, so I can promote her a lot if I really want to or need to. But again, I saved the characters on. Um, that I can sell if I don't want to get them straight away and just do that whenever I need to so I'm quite um, hit and miss like that that's just me personally again everyone plays the game differently um, but again I'll just rank up the first move um, and that's it and Black Adam again I haven't ranked up any of his moves and I've got a promotion on him as well um, but again that's just me um, what I'll do I'll take the gears off um, just so it can so you can obviously have an idea of I wish I could just take it off like that. They, they make some of these things a bit annoying how, how to use them. But yeah, I'll take all gears off so you can see the character in their raw form. And hopefully um, it will be quite doable. But things to look out for is the not mainly the strength for me. I look, mainly look at health. As long as I, can, I know that a move that I can do on somebody can take off a, a decent chunk of the health, then I know I'm going to be okay. But having someone like Nightwing or someone that can take away their energy which will prevent them from using their moves on you is always something you want to consider when you play in a game. Um, so people like Nightwing, um, Lex Luthor, uh, Green Arrow, always someone good to have. And there you go, this is what I've been paired off with. So I've got a bronze character. Um, this is a bronze character but he's obviously a, a boss character and the reason why he's got a good strength and health and there's a silver character Doomsday as well. Um, so again, when you've got someone like a bronze character and you know you've got a character that can do a lot of damage swap your characters out and let this weak character build up your character's um, energy so then you can use them against your opponents and it's those little things that you got to think about when you're playing a game to use it in your favor and then obviously I can tag out and put in Black Adam now and he's going to probably get a little bit upset because he's doing damage on me when he shouldn't be <laughs> or damage to himself should I say and now he's gonna tag out and as soon as he tags out I'll just take away some energy from him so he can't do a move on me there's two night winging oh, he's just blocking everything one thing I hate about this green man, he blocks everything you do. <laughs> and he's not giving me a chance to do anything. There we go. Well, I can get some damage on him. And now I'm going to tag out. Oh, he's not tagging out. Okay, tag out when you want. There we go. Just so that you can't use that move on me. And one more time, and then I'll put in Catwoman. I'll do the second move on Catwoman, because I just love seeing it. Yeah. 
Let's do a first move. Put in Black Adam. And that's one down. Two down. And three down. Again, the other two characters are completely random. I didn't know who I was going to get. You won't know who you're going to get. But again, sometimes it's trial and error. Sometimes it's luck. Sometimes it's just having the right characters at a decent strength. But again, if you're going to focus on ranking up any of their moves, make sure you focus on the moves that you know is going to help you in that match. Or just help you for promoting that character in a sense. Because again, you can see how much credits you get on this one match. Um, and the other four matches are pretty much the same amount, which gets you 20,000. But again, it's using that money... See, I've got like oh, nearly half a half a mil. Um, it's about, about using that money to your benefit. Um, again, guys, like, comment, subscribe, and you'll see me on the next video. Take care.